Okay, let this interrogation begin. So the reason why you're in here because you are being interrogated for your crimes for being rude to the customers way too many times. Boris, ever since episode 1, you have been an absolute pain when you lied to me about salad not being available. And then, at your third job at Dave and Buster's, which I will mention, you lied to me. Even at your other jobs too. Even though you were let off at your hotel job. But are your other jobs? You were just plain on rude to me and other customers. And I had to fire you so many times. And you are almost at your 100th job. And this is just crazy. So Boris. Any questions? And don't you dare lie to me, because I can just review the security cameras if you're going to lie to me, so don't try. So, what's the point of this interrogation? First, I had an argument with Vanessa, and was later knocked out by her. Third, had to self-quarantine with you guys for like a week, and now we're here. Okay, so the reason why I was rude to the customers it's because they want to be something that's already sold out. So that's why I want to get 100 over with. Also, you do make a good point there. Also, that's the reason why I was rude to the customers. Okay, since we got all the questions we need. When Superstar Luna was telling me, you were trying to frame another work employee for something he did not do. And that's a problem. Come on. That employee had it coming. Vanessa, you're free to go. I need Strawberry Nicholas to come in now. Okay guys. I'm here and I got all the information you got. And yes. I did fire Boris foremost at his third job. This interrogation will occur once we answer him some questions. Okay. So I have some questions for you. So the reason why we have you in here because you violated the social distancing order. Also, you also escaped from Crystal Inkling 28 while she was trying to escape you. And I also heard that you sneaked into our Beyond Universe to work at GBPMC side dinner, even though that job was not given to you by the creator yet. You also broke a lot of rules. According to Go Big Planet Mate 3854. You also broke other laws too. Also, you were being rude to the customers, lying about us not having items, taking money that is supposed to be given to you. You have delayed your future phone bills, being rude to a lot of yonders, ending up on the news twice, and for not wearing a face mask to work where we literally have a freaking pandemic going on, and more stuff. And I'm glad I started my own team to talk to you. You have been rude to the customers a lot, and we searched the entire city for you. We searched in San Francisco, San Jose, Los Angeles, Chicago, New York, Sydney, Australia, cities like that. And we do not want to lock you up in jail, but you really need to control to how you talk to customers, stuff like that. And that is not good at all. And you have been very rude to the customs in a very bad way and that needs to stop. We will let you go since we have no charges against you. We will let you off. But you need to find another way to be rude to the customers. Or don't do it at all. You violated rules section 100. Also, we will be watching, and I will have my friends keep an eye on you to make sure you're not saying anything inappropriate to the customers. You are free to go. Interrogation over. Huh. I never knew this interrogation would be so short. Go big. He's JSUT going to do it again. You never knew what's going to happen next. Due to what I heard from other users T.O. be honest. You make a good point. But we will see how it goes and when he works at my seaside restaurant. I have faster Wi-Fi so it will be easier to monitor what he is doing and saying. We will have another interrogation like this, but please don't tell him we're doing it. Thank you. You guys are free to come with me so I can go over the next missions.